In this video, I'm going to be listing 10 cheapest university in Poland. And also, these universities, most of them, they're going to start application in March. Probably when you see this video, it's definitely going to be in March. And some, the application is going to start in April. So if you're interested in studying in Poland, then you should watch this video. Welcome back guys. If this is your first time of coming to my channel, hello, my name is Julia Isegi, as well known as Nurse Julia. So do well to subscribe and also turn on the notification bell. So in this video, I'm going to start with the most cheapest to about the most expensive of all. And in between, I'm going to be letting you all know some of these universities you can apply for financial aid. So they kind of have a tuition fee waiver. And most of these university, not all the courses you tend to have tuition fee. So waiver. number one on the list is cool yes catholica universitat lublin yeah so uh, now let's jump into the website let's see what the website have for us so now this is the website what i basically did was to um go straight to the information that we actually need so you just go to the website and look around so you know what you're looking for so you go to international students so they have limited course for masters and also bsc in english so go to international applicant and you will see information here for you make sure you read this information very well before you go ahead with your application yeah so these are the courses available for bsc and master about seven courses for bsc and also masters about seven courses available for you yeah for english speakers if you want to study in english then you can as well look also look at this uh, career path and uh, opportunities and workplace so you have opportunity for erasmus and also there's opportunity for financial aid too the tuition fee is very very affordable so financial aid is not something you will really want to like because the process is always very very tedious so what you need to do next is you create an account before you apply you create an account creating an account is very very easy you always make sure you use google chrome so that you can always translate it to english yeah so you register create an account accept then i'm not going to show you the process of creating an account i just want to show you how it looks like so this is all the information you need to put then where they said Percel, overlook the Percel. you don't have Percel yet so it's not compulsory for you because you're not yet resident in poland so you overlook that I could remember some people they had issues with how will they get Percel? They don't know how to get Percel. That's a different challenge. So it's not compulsory, you don't need it. So now let's move on to the tuition fee. Yeah, it's very important. And sometimes it may be difficult to see where the tuition fee is located. So you just need it to you need to type it in the search um, menu up there to take you to straight to the tuition fee. So these are the available tuition fee for the you see the list of courses you see some that is free why some the ones you see free that is no tuition fee you know that one is for eu um citizen citizens so you are not in your citizens so definitely you go to the region where say fee paying basis you click on that so that is where you own uh, that is where you fall in so you now look at the tuition fee you can see applied anthropology tuition fee uh, ranges from 2280 um, pll to about 4000 4560 pll is for the whole year a semester is 2280 pll that's about that's not um up to let's say that's 500 euro then they have other cheaper ones there that's um that there are ways they can cut down on the tuition fee so you need to write to the international office like i said you have to check the website i don't want to like read everything i don't want this video so lengthy because i still have other university to mention in this video so you've seen the tuition fee very 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 affordable 
and also there's something about code that you still need to know for you to apply to this school you need to legalize your documents even if you are coming from africa you're coming from india from asia for to apply to cool you need to legalize your documents and they have application fee of i think 85 is what that's like about 25 euro admission starts match in short admission have already started in cool and also they have hostels their hostels is very very aff affordable i did a video of a dormitory in cool so you can check the video i will leave it here next on the list is uni opo yeah you heard me right uni opo remember these universities are in remote city but if you know your way you can always work in other cities and depending on the course you're studying if it's a course that gives you time you can always work in other cities but your first entry in poland if you are Work, working on a particular budget that is so so tight then the f previous one i mentioned and this university we come to your aid so now let's see what uniopo have for us so now this is university of opo some call it opole why is that we call it opo so you need to convert it to english for you to see exactly um to understand what you're writing here so this is how the site looks like so you check it out i'm not going to read everything check it out so you know um, what next they have so we're going to go to the tuition fee that is the most important thing that is the reason why i'm doing this video you can see here um registration fee is about 85 pll just the account you're supposed to pay your registration fee to if you cannot do that yourself you can tell someone in poland to help you then there's a rule for information for refund of your registration fee if you didn't get your admission definitely it's going to be refunded back to you so check the website so that you get to see more of the information here so now this is their tuition fee is about 1500 euro per year you can pay 750 and also 1100 euro per year you can pay um 550 they also have financial aid you have to write to their international office for more details on how to apply for their financial aid yeah and this um there's a question here the special bank account for those paying to show fee from nigeria poland united kingdom and france so take note of that before you go ahead to pay your tuition fee so that is that for um uni Opo website so something good about University of Opo Opole is that the, the tuition fee is very affordable. They have the city is very very cheap and they have hostel accommodation. So the school will give you hostel accommodation um letter. But for cool cool hostel um accommodation, it's kind of like tedious for you to you have to apply for um, admission after admission then you now apply for the accommodation and the accommodation follow a different process so by then you must have submitted your visa so you may need another accommodation letter or try to book for another accommodation for you to apply to cool but for pole is different the school gives you accommodation letter and the accommodation letter is so detailed remember there are information that need to be in your accommodation letter so that you don't get denied the cost of the accommodation need to be there and also the address of the accommodation and the school need to state it that they have given you accommod they have booked accommodation for you not saying that there is available accommodation so note that is very very important so that's good thing about opole so remember that city is in a remote environment so job may be one of the may want be one of the or challenge but depending on the course you are doing there if it's a course that gives you time you can always go to other city to hustle yes like what my nigeria people say hustle and look for money so the next on the list is vistula university vistula i don't know why people are not talking about vistula most of the videos i've seen online talking about cheapest university in poland i've never seen them mention vistula vistula is very affordable and they have about two campus and the university is in a very in in the mega city of poland which is warsaw so let's look at what this what they have for us vistula Uni university um yeah so this is how the site looks like i'm not going to say everything here you have to check it by you have to check the site to know what you to check for informations that really interest you so i'm going to like skim through and let you all know the most important thing here so these are the costs available you can see 1750 euro per year and we have 2500 euro 2000 euro 
and also 2005 so you need to check the site to see the cost that is available for you and how much and also there is financial aid yes there is opportunity to pay for a semester not compulsory pay the one full semester so check the site and see what um courses you would want to go for and how much it costs and see how you can um have a financial aid like i said and it's also available here so now let's check the um campus because it has two campus so now the first one is in warsaw and the other one is Portic shock <laughs> don't know if i pronounce it very well so you can check them out and see which campus um, offers the course that interests you yeah so the these two um city like i said also is a mega city so there's always available job there so now remember always convert to english and yeah and i noticed most of the courses available in warsaw is also available in the other campus i think about one or two the other campus have graphic design so the one in warsaw i'm not so sure but you check it out and know the one that works best for you and the tuition fee are still the same just different city so check it out so like i said um there is a drawback about vistula university i heard that they allow tuition fee refund but the problem with the refund it may take a while for you to get your refund yeah most people it can take you three months four months yes for you to get your refund and they can be they, they are a bit slow in refunding tuition fee they refund your tuition fee complete check their website you want to chat with one of their representatives they are mostly students that are working in the university as like well i say customer care person like international most where if you're international student if wherever you come from even if you are from china and you chat you want to chat with the representative they will definitely assign a student from your region to you that understand you better that's something about they have um, they are easy they they easily reachable but when it comes to tuition fee refund that's what takes a lot of time within three four months you should be able to get your tuition fee back another on the list is amu <laughs> My Igbo um, people, Nigerians from the eastern part of Nigeria, we, we kind of like, what is the meaning of Amu? Yes, there's a school called Amu. It means Adams, something, something, let me get the name properly. <laughs> so it means University Adam, Adama Mishkevishna Posna. This university is in Posna. So, Usually, in short, we usually call it Amu, Amu, Amu. <laughs> the first day I heard of, of this university, I was like, what is it, Amu? Why did they name it Amu? So when I got the full name, I was like, wow, if only these people know what Amu actually mean in my country. <laughs> so now, back to business. So let's look at what they have for us. Let's check the site. So now this is their website. They have varieties of course um they have a whole lot of course so you check and type the kind of course that interests you so you should be able to see the one that really interests you so it's named alph alphabetical so you definitely see a course that you want so now let's move to the next the main site where we look at the tuition so now this is the site for the tuition fee so the tuition fee rate is 4,000 PLL per semester and also they have 3,000 PLL per semester. They also have lower tuition fee which is 1,500 PLL per semester but it's a different course, Library, Art and Science, Physics of Advanced Material for Energy Processing. They even have the one of zero PLL per semester which is free tuition fee for bio biotechnology chemistry so check out this site you will definitely see a course that you want like i said always check the site even if i show you to show and feel the amount check the site you will definitely see a course that they offer for free yes contact the international office last with them tell them what you want and they're going to see what works for you there's also opportunity for financial aid yes you click on financial aid you see scholarship if you want scholarship full funded scholarship is available these are the process you need to like getting scholarship is not really easy but it's doable so financial aid more like part payment to show fee waiver check the website go through you definitely see what you want 
So like I said, in this university, you have opportunity to apply for financial aid and as for the tuition fee refund, they actually refund your tuition fee and they also give you opportunity to like extend arrival time. Yeah, they also do that. But as for the hostel, I'm not so sure about the hostel. You can write to the school to know if they have a hostel accommodation to offer. So another university that you can still check out is Po Posner University of Life Science. I've had two people I have viewed in this in my channel. One is uh, he graduated from Posner University of Life Science a few months back. So he's now working. He said a whole lot about uh, Posner, the university and also accommodation. You need to watch that video. I'll drop it here or check the comment section for it it was a 40 minutes sure that video was like an hour plus i have to cut down some place where we were laughing and everything i have to leave the most important information that will help those coming to posner so if you planning to study in posner even if it's not in this university check out that video you will learn a lot in that video posner university of life science the tuition fee is very affordable they also have hostels accommodation for you so this is the website so you look out for the course that's available for you if you're going from msc and or phd and also there's a opportunity for erasmus where you go to other country to continue your studies there are different courses available here but most of my friends study here mainly masters so now let's look at the tuition fee so um msc in our greek food economy tuition fee is two thousand euro for and the whole duration of the course so you can pay 500 euro per semester you can pay one semester depends on um, how much you have you can pay 1000 euro per semester the tuition fee in this school is very affordable but majority of the courses are in the science are greek science engineering kind of mix so um you have a look you need to check out the website and see um if there's any available course for you they have more than six courses you can choose from check it out and see if it's actually what you want okay guys the next on the list is academy of finance and it's not too far from warsaw so you can always work in warsaw if you don't have a job there but any city that is so close to warsaw actually don't have issues with getting a job so this is their website um it is now called um eastern europe academic of applied science in bia Bushtok. initially it was called um university of finance and management yeah but now they've changed the name so um let's look at um what they have look at their tuition fee this is a um, registration fee one thousand uh, hundred and fifty euro then first year fee is 1500 euro yeah so depending on the cost that's for bachelors then the masters is 1700 euro for one year so you can pay a semester so send mail to their international office to know uh, what is their payment mode so check out the site i won't really say too much here check out the site every information you want is readily available for you in the site so like i said this university is very close to warsaw so you will definitely not have issues with getting job yeah so what you need to do is check the website and at this moment their application is ongoing so i'm not really sure about the accommodation send mail to the international office for you to find out information about the accommodation so the seventh on the list is university of warsaw there are some course in this university that is very very affordable why some is for free yes absolutely for free and the ones you see for free are very very competitive so you need to have two two one and above but if you have two two and you have a whole lot of work experience you may be lucky and majority of the friends i know that study in that university they went for their masters we're going to see the website and see how what they have which course you're going to take for free and also the ones you have to pay tuition fee so they have courses for undergraduate studies which is for three years and they have for postgraduate studies so now let's look at the course available in details so this is the section for application fees so the application fee is very affordable not expensive 
and read this information written here because there's some information they are passing out here before you go ahead to pay application fee which is about um, 85 PLL so and there's another application fee for 100 PLL I guess that's for masters so this is the information of the bank account details you have to pay your application fee too so you can tell someone in Poland to help you or anywhere in Europe they can as well help you to pay your application fee paying it from uh, most try if you're in West Africa it can be very very difficult so now we go to the tuition fee which is will more which is important information that everyone is actually looking out for so now in the tuition fee um these are the available courses you can see the ones that um first cycle means bachelor's then second cycle means um masters so you can see anywhere you're seeing a blank like chemistry you didn't see anything there that means it's not offered in english and you can see for masters is available for english for masters which goes for 3000 pll and the data science goes for 2200 euro so you check it very well anywhere you see blank it is not available so most of the fee here are in pll in euro yeah so uh, they have limited course for bsc but they have more of master's course so there's a course for free which is religious of uh, asia is for free and they have uh, physics for free they have uh, orientation studies for free that's for master's level then they have a um, machine learning for free so what you need to do is check the website um look at the ones they have for free and the ones they have for um there's also another one archaeology they have it for bsc for free and also to master's level for free so check the website remember in this university you have opportunity to uh for accommodation they also offer you accommodation and the accommodation is very very affordable i did a vlog video in this university and dorm dormitory you can check the video in this place yes i i showed a whole lot of things in this video in that particular hostel is also made for is also for it's like a unisex hostel they have maybe probably a particular floor for female then the down ground floor for male yeah and i showed a whole lot of things in that video so check it out number eight on the list is university of science is university of science and technology they call it agh yeah so you should i've heard a lot of people talking about this university that is very very affordable and also it is located in krakow so something good about that krakow is that pronounce it where is it krakow yeah krakow something good about that um city is that it has a whole lot of job av availability for immigrants so you will not have issues with getting a job unlike those in opole and lublin depending on your course if your course will allow you to will give you the time to go to other cities to work so now let's see what the website have for us so now this is the website i just went straight to where we need major information you can as well um check it at your own convenient time the first circle second circle they even have exchange program summer courses so if you are in another european country and you want to do exchange course so um such um is available for you to do that in this university so now let's go straight to um this is first cycle which is bachelor degree so let's look look at the tuition fee how much is their tuition fee remember they have courses for polish and also for even their polish student also pay tuition fee here you can see um degree program in polish and also degree program you can see the degree program in, uh, in first circle which is your degree is not available for that of mining engineering but it's available for masters the one you're seeing by your left the 1500 euro and the rest is for those courses are available for um polish they teach them in polish then um when you keep checking down they have limited course for english like this one 2300 euro is available for masters so it's mainly this school mainly um favor masters student so if you are uh, planning to come for your masters then you check the school they also have you can see 2000 euro for computer science they have it for bsc but they don't have it for masters 
Yeah, so and they have 1000 electronics and telecommunication, 1750 euro for BSc and um, 2000 euro per year for masters. This is per year. The other one you see, 1500 euro is. Uh, in Polish, if you want to study in Polish, so they have mechanic engineering, mainly engineering courses they have in this school. So check out the website; you definitely see what you want. Go through it from um, check all the courses. I think they have more of masters courses. They have only few so far. We've seen about four courses for. They have computer science, engineering, mechatronic for BSc. So you check and. You know what you're going for so important information read all the information before you go ahead with your application is very very important look at their refund procedures i always say that make sure you look at their tuition refund in case you didn't get your visa and you want a tuition fee refund look at the uh, requirements to refund your tuition fee some schools may not give you complete they may take administrative of administrative fee from the tuition fee ranges between 100 euro sometimes 200 euro it depends why some schools they give you full tuition fee refund so ask them send mail to the school so that you know how their procedures looks like and they also have an uh, opportunity for scholarship yes scholarship is available what you just need to do is send mail to this international office so that you know the procedure what you need to submit L all schools in Poland, they have scholarship available for international students. Sometimes they may not put it on their website. Send mail for you to know the information and procedures needed. So next on the list, which is number nine, is Jagiellonia University, located also in Krakow. So there's something good about this university. It's not so affordable, but if you're thinking of studying medicine, you want affordable that you can study your medicine, then you should think about this university. Their medical uh, tuition fee ranges between 11,000 euro per year to about 14,000 euro, depending. So I'm going to show you the website. Now let's look at the website and see what they have. So now this is the website. Um, what you need to do is check for English programs. They have more of medical courses here. If you want to study medicine, I think this school is one of the best. And also Gidans is also one of the best for medicine. And uh, let's look at the application fee. So application fee is about 100 PLL. And check down you will see the information on how to pay your application fee you can tell someone to help you pay in any part of Europe they can help you pay even in UK and also they can always help you pay your tuition fee and there's always tuition fee refund so check the website and so now let's look at the tuition fee in particular the school is a bit expensive they have tuition fee of 2200 euro for ecology and uh, evolution they also have for 14,000 euro that is for medical courses if you want to study medicine so you pay 14,000 euro for per year so there's um this program if you want to change form of financing after the beginning of the study there are ways you can get financial aid like i said you won't see the financial aid details on the website until you contact the international office they, they will give you a breakdown on how to go about the financial aid so the last on the list is university of silesia this university is in katowice that i i have a friend that studied their masters but um he kind of like moved to other city to work not that like there's no job there after all the you know, city is a bit um more like the lublin city is bigger than that city but i think the problem with lublin they have more of international students that is why getting job in lublin is a bit very very difficult but that city they don't have a whole lot of international students but their tuition fee is still very very affordable between the range of two thousand 
and you can even get for 1,800. Something about this tuition fee is you need to send mail to the international office. There's something they call tuition fee bargain. Most especially in this public universities, you can bargain your tuition fee depending on your merit score in your previous, if you're coming for master's. If you're also coming for BSc, if your O level, you did very, very well, there's a way you can always request for financial aid. There are other tuition fee waiver, maybe like 20%, 30 percent it does exist in poland so you need to contact the international office for that they will not tell you available aids that you can apply for so now let's look at this website and see what the university have for us so i just have to go straight to um the main topic which is the tuition fee you can see tuition fee varies from 500 euro to about 2500 euro depending on your course so we're starting off with the application step so this is the application step if you want to know in details check the website yeah check the website you will see um yeah you'll be able to it's able to direct you to where you get information on the application step and also the required documents you need to apply so there's available bsc courses and also for um masters is also available here like you saw in the previous clip 500 euro to about 2500 euro that's it so that is that for the list for now there are still other university like private university that is still kind of affordable looking at uh vicent paul university you're talking about vc which you can get tuition fee from like 2500 euro to about 4000 euro yes it's available for you they have different mood of uh, teaching and this university is very easy to get admission and anything you want like your accommodation they will provide it for you anyhow you want them to write it in the accommodation most of the accommodation they will do that for you so they are a bit very flexible and easy to reach out to the university international office if you have a request or maybe uh, at the embassy they request you to bring this and that information so i said a whole lot of things about for those studying nurses remember this video Video is basically not for only those studying nurses basically for those studying other course so if you are here you have interest in studying nursing you can also check out the university if they have option for nurses and if you want to like streamline your check your search then i have a video where i made about 10 universities where you can study your nursing please check the video i will leave it here also in the description section or you check my playlist in case i didn't leave it in the description section check my playlist i mentioned 10 universities where you can study your nursing i also have a video where if you want to study your nursing how to look how to search for the best university when you want to study your nursing there are a whole lot of factors you need to consider before choosing a university to study your nursing so guys that brings us to the end of this video i hope you love it please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also thumbs up this video it helps youtube to suggest my videos to others that may want to watch my video and also share with your friends if you have people that want to study here in poland please share with them i noticed now that polish uh, embassy have been like issuing out visas compared to 2022 where it's is a whole lot of headache to get your visa most especially those applying from west africa but now they've been issuing visa limited rejection so if you've been rejected please look at the reason why they reject you check your form maybe probably there's some information you did not fill on the form or maybe probably there are some wrong information you filled so check your form very well and check your accommodation accommodation is still one of the reasons some visas are being rejected so i'm going to do a video of my experience of during my visa application why i was rejected yes my first application i was rejected i have to reapply so i'm going to do a video of that when i have the time yes guys so guys i'll see you in my next video bye bye